Okay, now you can see that I've finished the next row and these are all my single crochet, right? Uh, my double crochet right here. And it looks a little strange now, but you can see this is where the hat goes from just regular straight from post double crochet to the nice the diamond pattern we have going on here. In order to start our diamond pattern, you have to chain one. Then we're going to single crochet in that same join space from the previous join. And we're going to single crochet in the next. And these are basically what I like to think of as traveling stitches. Basically what you want your hook to do is to travel into the center or near about to the center of the two front post double crochet because this will create our point. This is where our diamond point will be. And diamond clusters are worked just like a triple crochet. So we're going to wrap our yarn around our hook twice and we're going to start with this back front post double crochet right here, the one behind our hook. And we're going to slip our hook right under it and wrap the yarn around and pull through. And we're going to work it just like a triple crochet. So we're going to pull through those first two loops, wrap around, and do the next two loops. And then you're going to stop. That's one side of our diamond. We're going to leave those last two loops on the hook and we're going to wrap around again and we're going to work another triple crochet right under the front post in front of the hook this time now. So I'm going to go right underneath that, wrap my yarn around and pull through and then I'm going to work it just like a regular triple crochet. So under the first two loops, wrap around under the next two loops and you'll end up with three loops on your hook. So you wrap around and then just draw your yarn through all three loops and you've got your first diamond point. See? Told you it was simple. Then you're going to skip the stitch here and you're going right here, this stitch right here, and you're going to single crochet in the next three so you can travel to the center of your next diamond point and you're going to repeat the pattern. So you're going to wrap the yarn around twice and go through the back front post double crochet and work through the two loops around through the next two loops leaving those last two loops on your hook and wrap around twice and you're going to go through the first cluster, the, the first front double uh, front post double crochet in front of your hook and wrap your yarn around and under it and then work just a regular triple crochet. So through the first two loops, around through the second two loops and you'll have three loops left on the hook, yarn over and through the last three loops on the hook and those are your first two diamond points. Then you'll skip that first stitch and you'll continue the pattern. It's the same pattern throughout the rest of the hat. You're going to wrap your yarn around twice over your hook, go through the back front post double crochet, yarn over and pull through, yarn over through the first two loops, yarn over through the second two loops. Now leave those two loops on your hook wrap the yarn twice and now go through the front here, the first one, the one in front of your hook, yarn over, pull it through, yarn over through the first two loops, yarn over through the second two loops, yarn over through the last three loops on your hook. Now you have three. I'm going to skip the first stitch single crochet in the next three so we can travel to the center here see my hook is now in the center of the last cluster we did here the last we're gonna wrap the yarn around twice and go through the back front post double crochet yarn over pull it through yarn over through the first two loops yarn over through the second two loops. I'm going to leave those last two loops on my hook. Yarn over twice through the front here. 
the first front post double crochet, pull your yarn through, yarn over through the first two loops, yarn over through the second two loops, yarn over and through the last three loops. See? Simple. I told you it would be easy. And that's our first four diamonds. Now you skip the stitch. We're going to single crochet in the next three to travel into the center and work our next cluster. Yarn over and we're going to do this all the way around this round. Yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, yarn over through the last three loops. Skip, single crochet in the next three, one, two, three, yarn over twice through the back, oops, move my camera a little, sorry, the back front post double crochet, yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, we're going to leave those last two loops on the hook, yarn over twice and we're going to work in the front right here. Oh, actually, right in here. There we go. Yarn over through the first two loops. Oops. Okay. Yarn over through those first two loops. Yarn over through the second two loops. Yarn over through the last three loops. There's another point. I'm going to skip the stitch. And in the next stitch, single crochet three times, one, two, three, to travel into the center. Yarn around twice. I'm going to work through this front post double crochet behind the hook. Yarn over through the two, yarn over through the next two. Two loops on our hook. Yarn over twice. Now we're going to work in this front post double crochet in front of our hook. Yarn over and through, yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, and then yarn over to make our point through all three loops on that hook. There's another point. We're going to skip that stitch and single crochet, single crochet, single crochet, yarn over twice, and we're going to go into that front post double crochet behind. Yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, leave the last two, yarn over twice, through the front post in front of our hook, yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, yarn over through the last three loops on our hook. There we go. And we're going to skip the stitch and we're going to continue this all the way around our hat. Once you get going, it's really quite simple. Yarn over twice through the front post double crochet behind the hook. Whoops, I dropped my yarn. Wrapped around twice. Let's try that again. Yarn over, yarn over. I have two loops left on my hook. Yarn over twice through the front post double crochet in front of my hook. Yarn over, yarn over, and here goes another point to another diamond. We'll skip that stitch, single crochet, single crochet, single crochet. See how I'm now in the middle of the next two ridges. So yarn over twice and into the front post double crochet behind the hook and yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, leave the last two. You don't want to go through those two, otherwise you won't have a point. Yarn over twice through the front post double crochet in front of my hook, yarn over through the first two, yarn over to the second two, and now we'll make another point. There's another point. Skip that first stitch and single crochet in the next three to travel to the center of our next point. Yarn over twice in the front post double crochet behind the hook. 
yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, then yarn around twice and into the post in front of my hook. Yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, yarn over through the last three. Skip that first stitch, single crochet in the next three, one, two, three. Wrap the yarn twice. I'm going to go into the post behind the hook and yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, leaving the last two. Sometimes I would crochet those out, so you really want to pay attention when you do those because you'll need them for your point. And then you'll work your next front post. There's another point. Skip that first stitch, three single crochet, one, two, three. They really do work up fast once you get this part down because this is the same stitch through the entire hat. It just alternates between this stitch, if I got my hook stuck. Let's back that out a little bit. Let's try that again. It alternates between this stitch and this, the double crochet stitch that we did before. So yarn over through the first two, yarn over through the second two, wrap it around twice, go through the front post in front of our, our hook, pull it through, and then work these stitches here. And through the last three, there's another point. Skip that first stitch, single crochet into the next, and the next, and the next. Wrap around twice. through the front post, double crochet behind our hook, through the first two, yarn over through the second two, wrap around twice, and through the front post, double crochet in front of our hook, yarn over around the front two, yarn over around the second two, yarn over through the last three. Skip that stitch, that first stitch, and single crochet in the next, and the next, and next, wrap the yarn twice and do it again. Leaving the last two, wrap around through the front here and through the last three on our hook. Skip that first stitch. Then one single crochet, two single crochet, three single crochet, wrap around twice. We're going to go into this back one here, wrap over through the first two loops, through the second two loops, leaving the last two, wrap around twice. And we're going to go through the, fr the front post double crochet in front of our hook, wrap around, go through the first two loops, wrap around, go through the second two loops then wrap around and through the last three loops. Skip that first stitch. I'm going to single crochet one, two, oops, three. Wrap around. We're going to go into this back front post double crochet right here behind the hook. Wrap around twice. I'm going to go into this one here. Wrap around through the last three loops on that hook. And skip that first one there. And right here we're going to do one, two, three. And this is our last in this round. We're going to go behind here. Wrap around through those two loops, wrap around through the next two loops. We're going to wrap around and we're going to join right here where we started. Okay, so we're going to wrap around and finish our diamond right here. The last three loops. Now, because we have two here, we need one single crochet right here so we keep everything even. So now that's three and we can join at the top here. 
join at the top and that is the end of that round so you can see how you have the tops to your diamonds on that first round now in order to do the next row you'll chain two and the only thing you have to do for this row is to double crochet in each space in each um, oops that's a single crochet in each stitch around so it'll be just like the round before this one so each stitch gets one double crochet I know it feels weird and strange and it's gonna look weird when you're done but trust me one double crochet in each stitch around and we'll pick it up after that 